That's a good question. I did a little research between the last part and this part, and it seems like Lucia and Dante's stories are actually different. So it seems like there's gonna I'm gonna be doing two playthroughs. Or at least I should say it's um their playthroughs uh, both are needed for a complete story understanding or something like that. I don't know, it was a forum post that I read that said like, yeah, hey, you need to play both, basically. So I'm gonna play both. It's just Dante first. Who's around? No one too bad, just Agno Agonophenes. These are just weird ass names. <laughs> they might have like a history in like demon lore or something, but I have I know nothing about them. So you know, they're just kind of weird. Goatling makes a little bit of sense because it's a goat. But they're goaty, like uh, like Satan is. Down here? Yeah. The fixed camera angles thing keeps freaking messing me up. I don't like it. Oh, I also looked up because I thought this was a prequel game. Uh, it's a, it's chronologically the last game in the series of the games that are currently released. Um, it's three that's a sequ or that's a prequel. I think three is a prequel to the first game too, not just like this game or anything. And I don't know when when four takes place. I'll look up a timeline at some point. Um, I know DMC is technically a reboot, but also kind of fits at the beginning of all of this, maybe? Or the beginning of every... of the, the, the current story. It's, a, it, it's like in the vein of Tomb Raider, of the new Tomb Raiders. It's a prequel reboot. Because, like, I haven't played any of the new Tomb Raiders either, but uh, I'm pretty sure, like, they fit into the the, for lack of a better term, the old canon. Um, the older games. But, uh, they also fit their own new canon. I don't know. I don't know how that works. I've never played any Tomb Raider game, not to mention a new or an old one. Um, on my list, I guess. I want to play the new ones, at least. The new ones look good. And I, I guess, like, the first one was a classic, and a couple of the other ones are good, from what I've been told. <sighs> nope, what is that? Oh, it's these things again. Um, I also haven't played any of the, like, 2.5D Lara Croft things. Not, they're not 2.5D, they're isometric. Um, I remember when the first came out. Because it was like a Summer of Arcade thing, I think. I used to love Summer of Arcade. So I got Shadow Complex. Which, as of this recording, I still haven't finished. Maybe I'll finish it before... These go up. These get uploaded. Or maybe I won't. Likely I won't. I don't know why I've had... I, it's taken me so long to, like, even try to go back to that. There's literally no reason for it. I'm just laziness, I guess. Is this how I'm supposed to be going this way? Or is this where I came from? This is not where I came from because these statues are intact. Oh, yeah. 
forgot what I wanted to upgrade next. I think it's my sword. The one on my back. Oh my god, Indiana Jones! What was that? <coughs> okay, so... Because I got Indiana Jones... Or, not Indiana Jones, because I didn't get away from the... Boulder. Um, the eyeball boulder thing. Because I didn't get away from it, I'm in a gauntlet. Okay. I guess it's better than killing me. Like, this way I can get some red orbs. Nope. I didn't want to be immediately dropped back. There were orbs up there for me. And the orbs gonna the ball the thing's gonna drop again, but I can run faster. Oh god! Did I die? What? Oh, I see. Probably if I'm waiting there when it falls again, I'm gonna die. So I've gotta hit it when it's up. And then... There we go. Okay, cool. This isn't bad so far, this level. It's alright. The camera works atrocious, but that's how it goes with Devil May Cry, it seems. Oh. Is the doorway? No. Yes? No. No. It's just a texture. The, uh, the red things there really screw with your depth, perce depth perception when you're up there. These pinky red platforms. Oh, god, what? can make it. I made them once. Like, once I got up here, I thought the pinky red ones were on my level. That's why I screwed up that last time I was doing this area. Where does this it's gonna open no what is it doing? Opening the floor? Maybe? I honestly don't know what it just did. But we'll see. It looks like there's some stuff up higher. Um do I have flight in? Nope. Now I do. Yeah, there is stuff over here. Cool, let's see it. Something. A couple of these jars with red orbs. A couple more jars. That are a little harder to break open. That one gives me nothing. <laughs> Still nothing. What? They're respawning? Am I supposed to break them in a certain time limit? I can only break, I have to break all three. Oh, 
Oh, okay, well, that one's weakened. Come on, I can do it. I don't even know what this is gonna. Yeah! Absolutely nothing. I just broke all three of them at the same time. I accidentally shot instead of rolling. I don't know what this is. Um. Oh, an upgrade spot. Do I use it? B. I want to use it. There we go. I think it was my sword. Yeah, I want to upgrade Vendetta. Cool. I'm gonna fall down the hole now. I guess I was supposed to go that way. Also, I feel like we fought this guy already. Ow, his wolves are wrecking me. Ow, he's wrecking me. Is he a re is he a super boss or is he like an actual big person I'm supposed to be fighting? Reason? Like what, what just happened to the wolves? Ouch! I want to hit him. I need to hit him, not the wolves. While I've got this going. Oh, and I killed a wolf. Or took it down, I guess, because it didn't die. He's really wrecking me, like, wow. Ah. Stun locks and crap. Get me out of the way. He also doesn't seem to take damage from my shotgun. But he'll take damage from Vendetta. And I think his Wolfie will uh, take shotgun damage. Kind of want to kill the Wolf now first, because it looks like the I killed the other one. Yeah, I killed him both. I can build up Devil Trigger by shooting at him. But it doesn't seem to be doing damage. He's blocking some of it. And also, youch. Lots of stabs. Uh, did I win? It looks like I won. That's cool. I like that. Let me break these pots now. And I will pick up that health in a moment. I want to get my rewards, reap my rewards, some might say. I don't think health carries over to the next level, but like, just in case. And also, I never know if this is the end, but it was the end of the mission, so that's good. I got rank B! Nice! That was good! I'm actually, I'm proud of myself there. Hmm. Alright. 